Hi everyone, it's me, Whimsy. I just thought I would stop by and talk a little bit about some of the news tonight, some of what's been breaking. As I said, we're going to start seeing a meltdown of the GOP, more cannibalism in the House, probably starting around Wednesday and going for the next three weeks. Uh, so we, we should see it start to warm up by Wednesday, but within tr three weeks, we're on a full-on uh, cannibalism in the house. So I just want to talk a little bit about the latest news. Looks like Charles McGonagall, FBI official, former FBI official, uh, has been linked to the Russian oligarch uh, Oleg Deripaska. I've mentioned Oleg Deripaska before, the oligarch linked with Putin. He also was uh, linked to Adam Waldman. Adam Waldman, of course, is the lawyer for Johnny Depp. I had a dream, I believe it was about a week ago, where Adam Waldman was surrounded by FBI agents and he was caught. I'm certainly hoping it's true. But it goes back to what I had said before, that the Amber Heard Johnny Depp trial was a hoax and that the money had been linked back to foreign money. And in the case of Waldman, I believe he was uh, introduced to Johnny Depp on Ben Zalman's private yacht. I'd also told you that based on the remotes, the mega yachts would be confiscated because they have cyber information on them about meetings that were taking place, candescent meetings. We now have several mega yachts that have been confiscated both by MI6, but also authorities in other countries as well as the United States. Some of those yachts have been uh, anonymous. The owners have been uh, anonymous, but they're linking them back to Russian uh, oligarchs. Last, I would say, is that I would just expect the arrest and the charges for people linked to the insurrection to start to heat up also in the next couple of days. I don't anticipate that McCarthy is going to be able to hold the House long term because I think we will be seeing further calls for George Santos to be removed. George Santos has said that he has a special surprise for the press on Tuesday. Maybe he'll wear a dress and tap dance uh, for the press. Uh, I don't know. Olag Deripaska has also been linked to WikiLeaks, evidently, and we do know that Julian Assange, we're trying to, the Americans are trying to extradite uh, Julian Assange back to the United States because he had taken information to try and uh, stolen from the DNC to try and undermine the DNC uh, also during the 2017 election and that Adam Waldman had met with Julian Assange I think it was at least five times. One of the things I saw in the remotes regarding Adam Waldman is the fact that the feds have been watching him for some time letting him get comfortable letting him get lazy because they've actually been monitoring, unbeknownst to him, his activities and who he's been communicating with, including communicating with Deripaska and anybody else linked to Deripaska. So I believe, Adam, I'm sorry, but I think you may be coming to the end of your good fortune, the end of your good luck, and I don't think anyone is more happy than I am. All right, thank you everybody for continuing to support this channel as we continue to do remote viewing using the heart-centered remote viewing technique. I will be back tomorrow at 5 p.m. for members only. Uh, I will be teaching another class on heart-centered remote viewing, and I hope you'll join us. Be well, everyone. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.